Steven Enzonzi is considering snubbing Arsenal in favour of Roma, according to reports. It is claimed that the French World Cup winner is now a target for the Italian side, who might need to replace Maxime Gonalans, who is a target for Crystal Palace. And Zonzi is expected to leave Sevilla this summer, but his £36 million release clause is likely to have to be paid in full. Calcio Mercado report that Roma are now set to lure Enzonzi see their way despite the strong interest from Arsenal. Gunners boss Anaya Emery has worked with Enzonzi in the past during their time at Sevilla together. Enzonzi won the World Cup with France this summer, image, AFP, Gillingham are facing a fight to hang on to giant Czech keeper Tomas Holy. The shot stopper, who stands 6 feet 9 inches tall, ended up at the lead one club last year following his release by Sparta Prague in his homeland. He became a near ever present, and now the Gills are bracing themselves for a late bid after the phone started ringing earlier this month. Gillingham are prepared to allow understudy Tom Hadler to step into Holy's shoes, with a string of clubs including Premier League sides Arsenal, Crystal Palace, West Ham and Everton having registered interest in the last few weeks. Championship duo West Brom and Middlesbrough are also keen on the 26-year-old. Arsenal have already signed goalkeeper Bernd Leno from Germany's Bayer Leverkusen this summer. But there are questions over the futures of longtime first choice Petr Cech and number two David Ospina. The goalkeeper could move to Arsenal. Image, Manchester Evening News. Emery expecting more from Arsenal and I. Emery warned Mesut Ozil and his fellow Arsenal stars they must work harder to win the ball back. The Gunners ran out comfortable winners against an understrength Paris Saint Germain side here in the National Stadium. With Ozil, who captained the Premier League outfit to end a difficult week on a positive note, scoring the first goal. Alex Locke is at twice, and fellow substitutes Rob Holding and Eddie Nketiah were also on the score sheet after Christopher Nkunku's penalty had leveled the scores. But even though this was a confidence-boosting victory and another important tune-up for when the real battles begin, Emery knows there is still plenty of work to be done. Emery says he wants to see more from his Arsenal team. Image, Getty Images AC pack, not least in his side's efforts to close down their opponents, something which, last night, did not impress him until he threw on his younger players midway through the second half. He said, in the first half, we played good football with quality players but I wanted to do the pressing better. We had this pressing with the young players later. The first idea is that we are working without the ball and on the pressing. It was only the first match for Mesut, Moel Nenny and Alex Iwobi. We only did one day tactical session this week. We looked at videos for movement and positioning, 